Hello. I want to show you how to use my French hook earwire jig. I designed it in the middle of the 90s and it was published in the Lapidary Journal. The, the whole idea is the economy. You know that when you buy um, a couple of hooks, it can be anything up to $1.50 a pair. Well, in fact, you can make your hooks with one little tiny piece of wire that costs just a few cents. So I'm going to clear this article out of the way and I'm going to show you how I work this jig. First of all, I cut my wire at a slight angle so that when the loop is around itself, it actually matches side to side. You'll see what I mean when you do it yourself. So you make your ring and then you twist it until it looks like that. It looks like that. Then you take your little tool, you put your, your first loop around there, you bring this one around the screw, you lift this one over there, and there it is. That's all you have to do. You cut it off here, you slip it off the gadget, you give it a little pinch to make it tighter. You file it down. Now, this stone, as you can see, is well used. And there's your hook. Now, you can make anything up to 150 of them in an hour. And really, you know, they're all perfect. And you can make them and sell them on the internet for a lot less money. Um, I'm using 20 gauge wire here, but they, they're beautiful with 18 gauge as well. This is 20 gauge half hard wire. So here we have it. Your stone, your cutters, mine have my initials on them, your little round nose pliers, and your wire. Now, you don't have to just cut your wire like that. You can actually work off a spool. And you can make lots of these in a very short time. So if you have large orders for any kind of um, um, boutique, you're going to get a, a, a really large economy out of this. Hope you like it.